Nasal congestion for people with chronic sinus problems it may feel like a cold that never quite goes away. Well, surgery could help you breathe a little easier. Mary Nichols with more in tonight's Check Your Health Report. Hi, Todd. How are you today? Great, thanks. Good. Things are better? Absolutely. I was self-diagnosing and taking medicine just to make myself feel better. For the past 10 years, Todd Wade had been suffering from chronic sinus infections. Constant headaches, constant earaches stuffed up nose, lots of medication. Having any congestion? Todd made an appointment to see Dr. Charles Katz, an ear, nose, and throat specialist at Altaview Hospital. Dr. Katz decided surgery would be the best option for Todd. Sinusitis is, is really more complex than just one, one entity. Many people associate sinus problems with allergies, but Dr. Katz says that's not always the case. So some of them are associated with allergies, but there's other people that have nasal polyps, or just narrowed openings between the, the sinuses and the nose, um, or other um, inflammatory conditions of the mucous membrane unrelated to allergies. Before surgery is considered, doctors will try medications. And when they've done that and, and the CT scan suggests that there's more of an, obstructu an obstructive structural problem, then we consider surgery. During the surgery, doctors use the CT scans to help them navigate through the sinus cavity. The surgery takes a few hours and patients will go home the same day. As for Todd, he's breathing easier, despite some horror stories he heard about sinus surgery. Lots of people warned me before, said so it's a horrible surgery, lots of pain, last, it doesn't always work. They were wrong. In today's times, you know, especially people don't want to go to a doctor and they want to grab something over the counter. They've seen a commercial that's something, you know. So I, I think that there's probably more out there that could be improved with, with some of the techniques we have today. Mary Nichols for Check Your Health. A popular over the counter medication is Afrin, and Dr. Katz says a lot of people get addicted to Afrin, which can cause even more damage. So if you do have chronic sinus problems, go see your doctor. And for more information, go to our website at KUTV.com and then click on the Check Your Health link.